When was the last time tech completely blew your mind? For me, it was unforgettable. Last year, I stepped into a self-driving robo-taxi, and the moment it started driving itself, my jaw literally dropped. It wasn't just the smooth turns or flawless stops. It was realizing the future I'd always imagined was already here. Mind-blowing, right? And hey, before we dive deeper, drop your mind-blowing tech moments in the comments. Seriously, I can't wait to read your stories. AI has quietly become a huge part of my daily routine. It writes stories, creates digital art I'd gladly display at home, and smoothly guides me through heavy traffic using Tesla's full self-driving tech. Check out this footage. Crazy smooth, right? Let's talk about something even more personal and mind-blowing. Humanoid Robot Companions First up, Sanctuary AI has been making significant strides with their general-purpose humanoid robot, Phoenix. Founded in 2018, Sanctuary AI has quickly risen in the robotics field, earning recognition for their innovations. They've recently integrated advanced tactile sensors into Phoenix's hands, allowing the robot to feel objects it interacts with. These sensors detect subtle pressures, enhancing precision in tasks like grasping and manipulating items. Without tactile feedback, robots rely solely on visual data, which can lead to inefficiencies. Our sensors provide real-time touch information, reducing errors and improving task performance. So, what if I told you that warehouses are about to run smoother, faster, and smarter without needing a single human hand to lift a box? Sounds like sci-fi, right? But trust me, it's happening right now, and Figures Helix robots are leading the charge. And I'm not just talking about basic conveyor belt automation. These things move like actual workers, adapting in real time to obstacles, rerouting themselves when needed, and even collaborating with other robots to make operations as smooth as possible. Now, why is this such a game changer? Well, for one, speed. Traditional warehouses rely on humans lifting, scanning, and moving items. That takes time. But Helix? They don't get tired. They don't take breaks. And they don't make costly mistakes. And here's the crazy part. Each robot can carry hundreds of pounds while navigating tight warehouse spaces with precision. Imagine what that means for industries like Amazon, Walmart, or any major shipping hub. Shifting gears, Boston Dynamics has unveiled an all-electric version of their humanoid robot, Atlas. This upgrade offers a broader range of motion and higher dexterity compared to its hydraulic predecessor. In their latest demonstration, Atlas showcased its ability to perform tasks autonomously in a simulated factory setting, moving objects and adapting to changes without human intervention. Atlas says transitioning to electric actuation has allowed Atlas to achieve more dynamic movements and operate more efficiently in various environments. Looking beyond Earth, Mux Robotics, based in Pune, India, is developing humanoid robots like Space Prime and Robo Prime for extraterrestrial exploration. These robots are designed to operate on the Moon and Mars, capable of gathering and analyzing planetary data which is crucial for future colonization efforts. Mux Robotics says their robots are engineered to withstand harsh off-world environments, performing tasks that are too risky or challenging for human explorers. In the realm of connectivity, Huawei, in collaboration with China Mobile and Leiju Robotics, has introduced the world's first 5G-powered humanoid robot. Unveiled at the Mobile World Congress 2025, this robot leverages 5G's ultra-low latency and high bandwidth to perform complex tasks in real time. By offloading heavy computing tasks to the cloud, the robot operates more efficiently, paving the way for advancements in industrial automation. Smart folks at places like MIT and Stanford are digging into this, pushing for AI rules to keep things from going too far. And I'm with them. We need some guardrails. This isn't just about tech, it's about us, our privacy, our roots, what we trust. Look, I'm no robotics whiz. 
just a guy who's equal parts stoked and spooked by all this. But here's the deal. We've got a say in where this goes. Amy from TCL isn't just a fancy gadget. It's an intuitive robot companion that genuinely feels personalized. Amy learns my playlist preferences, senses my mood shifts, and even throws in jokes that are eerily well-timed. It adapts to my daily life, suggesting relaxing music when stress levels spike or engaging me in casual, comforting conversations. It's surprisingly natural, almost like talking with a good friend who's always there, always attentive. Then, there's Tesla's Optimus. Optimus has stepped directly out of sci-fi and into our world. It interacts physically, handling tasks that require a human touch, like assisting children with homework, delicately unpacking groceries, or brewing a perfect cup of coffee. Thanks to advanced tactile sensors, Optimus can handle fragile items with precision and care, enhancing daily life in ways we only dream possible. But robots like Optimus aren't limited to household chores. They've already begun performing intricate surgeries with precision unmatched by human surgeons. Videos showcasing robots smoothly playing soccer, performing fluid dances, or handling delicate glassware without breaking a single piece have gone viral. These moments resonate because they blur the line between humans and machines in genuinely stunning ways. Humanoid robots aren't just novelty items. They're protectors and lifesavers. They could become first responders, rushing into fires, exploring dangerous environments, or assisting in disaster recovery efforts. With their superior strength and ability to withstand hazardous conditions, these robots could save countless human lives. Yet beyond physical tasks, AI companions also provide emotional and mental health support. AI Me could potentially offer companionship to elderly individuals, reducing loneliness and providing emotional comfort. Robots might recognize signs of anxiety or depression early, suggesting coping strategies, or even encouraging people to seek professional help. The potential here is enormous. But this exciting future also brings tough ethical questions. As robots become integrated into our daily lives, we have to face challenging questions about emotional boundaries. Could we get too emotionally dependent on AI companions? Will AI me know our deepest secrets overhearing private conversations, and who decides what they should remember or forget? There's also a pressing conversation around job displacement. Oxford researchers predict automation might eliminate millions of jobs by 2030, yet history shows technological advancement often creates new roles we've never imagined. It's crucial to prepare for both sides of this reality, balancing optimism with genuine caution. And here's another question. Should robots like I, me, or Tesla Optimus have rights or responsibilities? Should they be protected from mistreatment? Or could they even bear some responsibility for errors or mistakes they might make? These aren't distant hypothetical questions. They're happening now. Robots aren't just tools anymore. They're becoming extensions of ourselves, influencing our emotions, relationships, and society. We need clear ethical frameworks that help guide how we integrate this powerful technology responsibly. So, here's what I'm thinking. We need to talk more openly about all this. Engage your family, your friends, and colleagues. The future of AI isn't locked behind a lab door. It's ours to shape, and we need to actively participate in shaping it. In the next video, we'll tackle the gritty side of AI, biases, ethical dilemmas, power struggles, and the crucial issue of control. Make sure you hit subscribe because it's going to get intense. Thanks for hanging out with me.